This video will demonstrate how to install the Leviton TSL-06 toggle slide dimmer. Please be certain to follow all wiring instructions and diagrams provided with the product. If you're unsure about any part of the instructions, or you are not comfortable or familiar with working with electrical wiring, contact an electrician. When installing and terminating this Leviton device, have the following tools on hand. A flathead screwdriver, a Phillips head screwdriver, electrician's pliers, a wire stripper, electrical tape, and a handheld voltage tester. This installation takes approximately 15 minutes. The process shown follows general guidelines. Local codes take precedence. Be sure to turn the power off at the circuit breaker and use a voltage tester to ensure that the power is completely off. Now, we need to identify the hot wire. To do this, turn the circuit breaker back on. Carefully use the voltage tester to test each wire. The hot wire will be indicated by the tester. Once identified, turn off the circuit breaker to shut power, and test to ensure that the power is off. Use a small piece of electrical tape to label the hot wire. Identify whether the wiring application is a single pole or a three-way application. If the wiring in the wall box does not resemble either of these configurations, consult an electrician. We will proceed with a single pole application. Visit youtube.com slash Leviton to view a three-way installation video. This device offers the option of either wrapping leads around the terminal screws or using an external backwire clamp. We are going to demonstrate backwiring. Note, a neutral is not required for this installation. In this example, in the wall box, there is one black wire, which is the hot, a bare copper wire, which is the ground, and a black wire, which is the load wire. Keep in mind, the color of the wires can vary. The hot wire may be black or red. The ground wire could be green or bare copper. If you are unsure, contact an electrician. Next, you need to be sure that the wires are prepared for installation. Start by making sure the wires are straight and stripped according to the strip gauge located on the back of the device. To wire, connect the ground wire to the terminal screw marked GR. Connect the line hot wall box wire to the terminal screw marked BK. Connect the load wall box wire to the terminal screw marked RD. The remaining dimmer terminal screw marked RD should have a red insulation label affixed. Do not remove this label in this single pole application. Note, if insulating label is not affixed to red dimmer terminal screw, use electrical tape to cover. The device is now terminated. The TSL-06 is preset at the factory with the bulb selector switched to mode A, LED incandescent. For CFL bulb applications, the switch should be moved to mode B. Gently bend the wires and push them into the wall box. Screw in the mounting screws in the wall box mounting holes. We are now going to test the device. Restore power at circuit breaker or fuse. Move slider control lever to the highest position and move the toggle handle up. The lights should turn on to brightest level. If lights do not turn on, refer to the troubleshooting section of the instructions. Attach the wall plate. Your Leviton TSL-06 toggle slide dimmer is ready for use. For more information about the Leviton TSL-06 toggle slide dimmer, 
Visit levitin.com slash dimmers.